Hey everyone, Rarity Dash here, and this is the redirect to my reaction to Love Live, the School Idol movie. You'll find links to the reaction on Bitch and Ghoul's Drive in the description below. Go check it out and enjoy. So here we are. Yep, we've got the Love Live movie. That's the monthly movie for this month, and I know it's not going to please everyone. That's kind of what I said last time. This wouldn't please everyone. This is a much more niche film than what I normally would look at for this slot, but, uh, I mean, I kind of need to see it. I mean... It is the real conclusion to Love Live, uh, and apparently there's continuity of some sort for Sunshine, which I want to start this week. So, uh, yeah, the time is now, and I saw that this was going to be, that this movie reaction would uh, <laughs> would come right between when I was set to end Love Live and begin Love Live Sunshine, so I just, it, it lined up and I had to do it, which is why I did what I did. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I mean, obviously this isn't going to please everyone. This isn't nearly as mainstream as what I normally would do. It will please the Love Life fans, but, uh, you don't have to wait at all. You just immediately love live, love live movie, love live sunshine. But, uh, yeah, everyone else, uh, <laughs> might not be that happy. But the good news is for you guys that the poll is back. You'll notice it in the description. You can vote again and, uh... You can pick what I'm going to watch next month, and it's all the same choices as before, uh, except there are a couple additions. One, to replace the Lego movie, which was last month's winner, uh, we have the Lego Lego Batman movie, which, I mean, that's pretty much the obvious uh, option to go with there. Uh, but there's also another that was replaced, and that's Isle of Dogs, which was replaced because I happened to see it. Uh, yeah, I normally don't get around to seeing animated movies on my own, and since I started reacting to them, I've kind of liked it that way, but I was with someone who wanted to see it, it was on TV, and, uh, they're a fan of Wes Anderson and his, his films, so, uh, it just ended up happening, and, uh, nothing I can really do about it. It was good, though, by the way, if you're wondering my thoughts on that film. Uh, it probably wouldn't have ever won the poll anyway, it's kind of a more, more of an art film, more of a... <laughs> Uh, just not the kind of thing that would actually win, not really something with a lot of mainstream appeal. But it was really good. It was really uh, really weird. I mean, it had a very distinct look and feel to it, and uh, it was clever and fun in the way that Wes Anderson's films usually are, uh, which I'm also a fan. But, yeah, <laughs> it was good. But uh, unfortunately not going to be able to react to that one. But I've replaced it with uh, Ralph Breaks the Internet, which, uh, I mean, that was the month before I reacted to the first Wreck-It Ralph. And it just so happens that the sequel hits video. It comes out on video uh, mid-February. So it will be out in time for me to react to it uh, next month if you guys want to vote for it. Uh, so do so if you're inclined. Anyway, uh, all I got to say here, really, uh, so yeah, enjoy the reaction.